Hey, this is Ian Golden, and I'd like to take you through a few of my personal effects tricks in Tractor Pro using the X1 controller from Native Instruments. The Beat Masher or Beat Repeat effect is super fun and very effective, but it can get a little bit old. Let me show you how to polish it up and make it a little bit more interesting by just adding a few extra effects. The first thing you want to do is change your effects one to a chained effect. So you have three effects all in one slot. In the first slot, you want to go ahead and put the beat masher effect. In the second, let's use the filter 92 LFO. In the third, put a reverb or maybe a delay. Now set the two top parameter knobs to the middle setting. Engage them both at once and start to work the two knobs and find the perfect balance between the two. At the end of the buildup, kick in the delay or the reverb for a little extra polish. Rinse and repeat. 